This piece is untitled. Pathetic. You use that word to describe yourself so much that I'm beginning to think you forget what it means. Pathetic has become the alternative for saying, I feel sorry for myself. You feel pathetic when you have no one else to feel sorry for you. You are so desperate to become just as interesting as the characters you write about, aren't you? Well, here's a newsflash, sweetie. They only exist on paper. You are not paper, you are flesh and bone and blood, but over the years you have made yourself to be paper. Flimsy. Weak. Easily torn up. I want you to remember that on paper is where great stories are created, and if you are paper, then you are story come to life. I want you to breathe. I want you to let the words free. Your imagination is the key to remembering who you are. All the things you worry about now, what are they going to mean to you in the future? You are under no obligation to please anyone. I guess your mind must have forgotten that when it signed away the contract to your sanity. I want you to imagine hang gliding. Off a cliff. Off the Grand Canyon, you are a bird with the wind beneath your wings, and the wind is cool and rushes through your hair. I want you to imagine yourself in India helping women, in Chicago making fiction and reality collide, in Scotland pretending to be a princess and exploring castles. I want you to know that you can make this happen for yourself. It doesn't matter where you come from. I want you to remember that not being fictional doesn't make you less interesting, it makes you real. You are not a trope, a cliché, a characteristic, you are utterly, beautifully you. You can make your happy ending. And you can, will, move on from this.